Well, this is going to be take two of uh, market at the silos. So when we went there a couple of days ago, the line was ridiculous. And we just got there too late. So now we're leaving at 746. And they open at 9. Yeah. So let's see. <laughs> All right. Let's get out of here. Okay. <laughs> Bye, babies. All right, we'll see you over at uh, the silos. Here we are at the silos. And I mean, so far I think we're doing all right. We showed up, we got parking. <laughs> <laughs> Close. A four. Yeah. Let's go over here. Let's check it out. When we got here two days ago, and we were like, yeah, let's go visit this place and see what's going on. The line was almost all the way down that way with people waiting uh, to get inside. And then of course it snakes in through here. I mean, you see there's no one in line. Technically gonna be like the first, first ones. So, and I don't need to be the first one, but I don't wanna be in a line waiting out there. I'm letting everybody know on my Instagram and Facebook. <laughs> we're the first ones in line. Yeah, about to go in. Yay! part of this adventure and spend some money somewhere else. Yes, please. Let's go. Let's boogie. Say bye to Madeline. Hey, <laughs> All right, rock and roll. See you, buddy. Yes, sir. And there you have it, guys. So, you know, if you like, uh, I don't know, what do you call this stuff? Home decor stuff, yeah. home stuff. Country chic. Country chic. They got some clothes and some hats. Um, it's Shirts, definitely a cool sweaters. place. Uh, it's a small place, so don't you know? Don't expect anything super huge. It is small mm -hmm. right now. It looks like they're under a lot of construction around here to kind of uh, expand it a little more for more people. Um, but it is kind of limited uh, due to COVID. So and that's okay. Uh, probably actually even gives you better or more walking limited space. Limited capacity. Yeah, limited capacity. You know, uh, but other than that, it's it's a really nice place. You know, just to come out and visit. We're gonna try to see, maybe hit the bakery, um, probably hit Magnolia Press, uh, which makes coffee. Mm -hmm. And then attached to it, there's uh, one of the gals here told me that there's access to Magnolia Home, which is their line of furniture. So we're gonna go over there and then uh, just see what we can. Uh, I don't know, spend some more money or oh yeah, spend some more money or something. I don't know. <laughs> so we'll see you over there. Okay.
So we're gonna stop over here at the uh, Magnolia Press. The line's a little bit shorter. Uh, the bakery is kind of long. Snickerdoodle latte. What size? I'll do a 16 ounce. And they warmed it up for us. Apple pie, cinnamon roll. First bite. Go ahead. Primicias? Yep, you go. You can have it. Okay. I'm not gonna say no. Mm -hmm. Is it good? Is mm -hmm. it decent? Mm -hmm. uh. Alright. Mm. Well, that's pretty good. I'm gonna check it out and then uh, we're gonna enjoy it and we'll see y'all in a little bit. It's a Magnolia home. Yeah. Nice furniture. I want a new home and I would have that, this look. That's nice stuff. So I'll, I'll dig it. Let's go, uh, let's go see what else we can find. I think, um, I think that's it for the Magnolia part of it. Throw the drone up and just show you around the silos and a little bit of downtown uh, Waco. It's clear and it's not that windy. So let me just show you around, alright? Well, that's uh, the end of Waco. Uh, we spent uh, five nights out here. Stayed in a little uh, RV park just outside of uh, Waco. Took about 20 minutes to get to downtown. We got to see the silos, hit a couple of shops and boutiques all throughout the place, hit the Harley dealer, visited Balcones Distillery, um, a lot of good restaurants. Uh, didn't even hit one chain. Uh, we did cook some steaks, uh, pork chop, and a ribeye. 
and uh, pretty much it was a really good weekend you know uh temperatures a little warm but they were mild they're not they weren't super hot like you know normally how they are but you know we're coming into fall pretty soon so but um you know that's it for this trip we'll be back because there's a couple of things that we still didn't get to do uh in those really four days that we were here um so look forward to the next video that we do on the rest of waco but until next time and wherever this truck and trailer take us deuces